Hi, sitting in the, the garage of my sister's house here in uh, Pinellas. Um, yesterday we went to Sarasota. It's a lovely resort. Uh, and we watched the sun almost go down over the, over the Gulf of Mexico. Really lovely. And, and looking out across, this is Lido Key. Um, a bit of a, a sand bank across here. It's all beautiful. The sand is uh, all crushed shells over many, many years. Fabulous. Very, very fine. White. And the sun was just going down here. It's a beautiful sky. I can, I can only approximate what it was like. So I'm using the uh, the what was it? The Canson paper. This time it was easier a bit. Well, I have worked the paper all over. I bought the paper. It's 140 pound weight. It's cold pressed. It's smoother than the Fabriano. I'm not a great lover of it, but it was cheap. And I've got two for the price of one, and there were 30 sheets in each block, 15 inches by 11. This is the size of the Fabriano, corset imperial. It was, I paid something like $16 for two blocks of it. So I've got 60 sheets of paper for the equivalent of, in, in the UK, of about £10. So I've got it, I'm going to use it. The weather has been a bit cold this week, but it's warming up now again. I'll get that nice and wet. There's a gentle breeze, it's going up to about mid 70s today, and warmer tomorrow. We're going to go sailing tomorrow. Okay, now as that expands, I'll put it tight. I hope you don't have any disturbances. Right, so I'm going to mix up a bit of alizarin crimson and lemon yellow as my orangey sky colour. I want to keep that middle quiet. Quite light. There the sun, so they say the sun was about there, but um, I can only approximate this. So we've got the, uh, the night clouds coming in across the... Uh, across the, uh, the Gulf. So I'll get a bit darker on the top. I'm light red and ultramarine for that. Oh. And what we had was um, some trees, some mangrove type trees here and oaks and just a bit of sand and grass. It looks like some of it's been quite recently planted. A smile for the camera, Dave and my brother-in-law, Dave. <laughs> Busy working on his gutters and his faces because everything rots around here. It's made of wood and has to be replaced, including his knee. Let's put in the, uh, the sea. I'll, I'll see if I can just get a bit of bit of yellow and a bit of sky, like a sun kind of in here. Then we go back to the blue of the sea. Making this up as I go along.
dying out already so let's go in with the uh, with some silhouetted trees so it'll be quite dark so I'll use some Payne's grey I'll make some green out of the general melee here burnt umber lemon yellow a little Payne's grey we're quite dark some darker colour into there now. Well, I'll draw in some uh, Some brushy, uh, some some trunks. Didn't know what I was going to say then. So we'll just get some of this darker stuff on there. So, umber, lemon yellow, and paint it grey. This is all it was, it was just a memory of just that silhouette. Nothing's too much trouble for my brother-in-law. Right, let's uh, draw into that. Ooh, the sun's out on my back. You can see the bright sun shining behind me. Right, there's a bit more scrubby trees here. Let's just get some more lemon yellow in there. I don't want these to come up too high because they won't. But this is just as I remember. That's my sister. She doesn't like to be on camera. She's a murderess really, and she wants to be incognito. Oh, so this grass sticking up here. Got sea oats, a lot of sea oats around this coast. Oh, it's so lovely here. Sarasota is a lovely uh, seaside sort of place, apart from uh, outside the, away from the commercial. Centre, lots of typical tourist shops, but some lovely cafes and restaurants, which we frequented. A lovely meal. The restaurant we used to go to, uh, Hemingway's, is, is sold out and it's been refurbished. I know, dude. I think that has dried a little bit flat and a bit dull because of the paint's grey. I really don't like paint's grey. But, hey, we've got it, so I'm going to use it. It's a good shortcut to... Uh, to the, 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 the greens. I'm using a very fine sort of rigger. This is the 
sides of the brush there. I'm using heavier rigger, number four, just to get some detail in the trees. Lovely wading birds, like dippers, little dippers, gorgeous little things. I like the pelicans. They look so ungainly when you're on there, but when they're gliding across the, the water, they are just wonderful. I'll add a bit of detail on, on this. Right, now I'm going to clean my palette and I want to put some shadow in on the white sand. It wouldn't be that white, but uh, let's clean my palette. Oh, it's burning. The nighttime temperature's been going down to around 40. So we put the duvet on. Uh, right, big burn up. So some footprints uh, and used by the car park. Right, a little bit of shadow in there I think. Detail on the oh here. Yeah. So I've got a little black, all my paint away. My nice yellow, which was out of the tube the other day, but it's been dirty now. Right, and then I'll put it in the mount and have a little look. There's a really good gallery in uh, Sarasota by the, in between all the restaurants. Really, some really good stuff in there. Some, even some Venice paintings, which were very, very colourful. Very, uh, because of the light down here. Colours in paintings, in American paintings, tend to be rather brighter than we're used to in Northern Europe. <laughs> Did you catch that on camera? <laughs> right, a good bit of uh, masking tape if I find it. I've been knit. Finale. <laughs> right. right. This is not this is the best I can do with the the colours that I'm using. Uh, right. So, so setting sun. Uh, I could have got more orange. I don't really want to. I'll, I'll probably do it again, but but anyway, that's an impression of it. It's not done from the photograph or with my computer. It's a memory of looking out from the car park of the, of the sun, but it was much more colour in the sky than I can get at the moment. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye for now. <laughs>